All right, what's going on, everyone? It's Groove of Gamers Inc. 194 here again today. We are checking out Walking Dead, season seven, episode four. So this episode, from the looks of the preview, it's going to be Negan's first visit to Alexandria, and people don't look too happy about it. it looks like a completely different sort of vibe going on there too, which I think is going to be really interesting to see how everyone else reacts to Negan. I hope they don't just cut to when Negan gets there. I hope they have a little bit beforehand, mainly when Rick just gets back with the people that were in the lineup. I feel like that would be a really emotional way to start the episode, a really good way to start the episode. I feel like they should do that and have him explain it to everybody first. I don't know if they're going to do that. I hope they do. Come on. Don't just start it right there. She's going all Sasha, man. What are you doing? Now is not the time for bonfires, Michonne. Oh, kind of, kind of interesting. They're just like, you know, where can we hide guns? Let's just shove it up the chimney. <laughs> I feel like she's definitely going to do kind of what Sasha did, though, and just kind of go and pick some off, pick off some walkers or something. Michonne, what, what are you doing? Now is definitely not the time for road trips. Can you open the gate? It sounded like a dog toy. The car break, Eugene. broke. Yeah. Open the gate. Back to your old selves. I don't believe I'd be up to that. Yeah, sounds about right. Ah, Rosita. I'm Rochette. repairing this portable audio system for them. We'll have a perfectly respectable music player when they arrive. I'm dealing in certainties, and I'm doing my part to give them what they want. They're here early. Eugene is so timid. And Rosita is totally like she was before. Oh, the whistle. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> little pig, little pig. Let me in. <laughs> was like a friend you'd totally be laughing but that's totally not their friend and they're totally not laughing <laughs> who are you oh, oh god you better be joking oh, god. negan lucille i know i had to make a pretty strong first impression rick did you not <sighs> well hello there rick don't be looking at him like that do not make me have to ask <laughs> Just something that you said a week you're early I missed you. <laughs> How adorable. They're becoming oh, besties already. Come on out here. Watch this. <laughs> Calling it. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Easy peasy lemon squeezy. God, I love him so much. All right, much. everybody. Let's get started. Wow. That's a lot of guys. Big day. Oh. There's Daryl. Who is that guy anyway? Do I get mad? Do I throw a fit? Do I bash some ginger's dome in? Nope. I just take care of one of these dead pricks that could have killed one of y'all. <laughs> Service. <laughs> Hold this. Oh. That's messed up, man. Oh, it's walking like he owns the place. Hot diggity dog. This place is magnificent. <laughs> An embarrassment of riches as they say. Daryl, hey. No. Uh, nope. He's the help. You don't look at him, you don't talk to him, and I don't make you chop anything off of him. Rosita. Right. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, she's got that snarky little... Mm. Dang. Look. <laughs> I feel like she's... A lot of suspense there. I don't think she even knew how much. All right, let's get this show on the road. See what kind of goodies you got in the cupboard. Put aside half the supplies. No, Rick. You don't decide what we take. Oh. 
That sucks. I do. But Rod, you heard the man. Move out! Rick, at least say something about Judith. Because I don't think Negan knows that he has a second kid. They're just gonna search the houses a bit, keep the process moving. Scott's up and walking, awesome. All right. Oh, did Rick? You gonna not show tell me around him? or not? Rick, give him the grandioso tour, Rick. <laughs> Rosita. Damn. Taking everything. Oh, you dick. I got a job for you. <laughs> Go get me Daryl's bike. It ain't here. Well, if it ain't here, then you know where it is, right? OK. You don't need her hat. Come on, dude. Now you're good to go. Bro. Seriously? OK, come on. Don't take too long. That was unnecessary. Michonne. Come on, we're a better shot than that. Seriously? somehow Ooh, we're back to see this really this is the kind of thing that just tickles my balls a little cooperation <laughs> and everything is pleasant as punch you see we really are reasonable people once you get to know us are you are you about honest oh Damn, I love this place. Negan. Something you might want to see. Well, well, well. What do we have oh, here? Interviews. He's going to learn all about Rick. I got my group. fingers crossed for a little freaky dinky. <laughs> Negan. You know me. I kill people. I don't she, know me. She's us. Is that you, Rick, underneath all that man bush? All those people out there. Shit. I would not have messed with that guy. Shouldn't have shaved, Rick. But that's not you anymore, is it? Oh, my God. Nope. <laughs> Whatever happened to that sick girl? That seemed like a hell of a stressful night for her. The way she was carrying on, she was married to number two, right? Careful. Careful how you're looking at me, Rick. Widows, especially ones that look like that, they are special. I love them. Rick. Right after their husbands go, they are just... Rick. Rick. Empty inside. Rick. Rick. But usually not for long. Rick. <laughs> uh, all the sexual in your ah, Rick. Please. Where is she? I would love to see her. Do you care to pay your respects? Holy crap! <laughs> you are creepy as shit. Sneaking up on me wearing that collar with that freaky ass smile. <laughs> My apologies. I'm Father Gabriel. She didn't make it? What? Damn tragedy. That's what this is. What? <sighs> Oh, this must really suck for you guys. No. Number one, that was on me. No choice there. Lessons had to be learned. No, no. Well, number two, mm. that didn't need to happen. Well, Daryl there, he forced my hand. Probably put her right on her back, huh? Damn. I was going to ask her to come back with me. How could I have a shot? Guy that just bashed her husband's head in. <laughs> You'd be surprised. Boy, say. people, they... that please don't tell me michonne's taking out saviors put some back or the next one goes on you 
<laughs> Carl! A kid. What do you think happens next? You oh, die. Shit. Carl. 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 Put it down. No. He's taking all of our medicine. They said only half our stuff. Of course. <laughs> oh, really, kid? Negan likes him. You should go before you find out how dangerous we all are. <laughs> oh, shit, Carl. Well, pardon me, young man. Excuse the shit out of my goddamn French, but did you just threaten me? Look, Carl. I get threatening Davy here, but I can't have it. Not him, not me. Carl, just put it down. Don't be rude, Rick. We are having a conversation here. I wonder what Negan would do if Carl just popped. Pop Where were we? Right there. Oh, yeah. You're giant man sized balls. <laughs> no threatening <laughs> us. Jesus, Carl. What Listen, you... I like you. So I don't want to go hard proving a point here. You don't want that. I said half your shit, and half is what I say it is. I'm serious. Do you want me to prove how serious? Carl. Again? Please. Please. This whole thing reminds me that you have a lot of guns. I can't allow that. God damn it, Carl. Look what you did. They're all mine now. Son of a bitch. Just tell me, Rick. Where are my guns? Carl. In life. Uh. 